All right, merch haul. It's been a while, but we are back with another Ami Ami unboxing video. Don't want to hold you guys up too long. It's not too, too major. Uh, so let's just hop right into the unboxing. First, we are going to start out with this bad boy right here. Um, so just FYI, there are no scale figures in this unboxing this month. Uh, this is for January 2022. Uh, AmiAmi took forever to invoice, which I understand because they're probably backed up. But we finally, finally got our stuff and I'm pretty excited for some of the things here. It's some pretty cool merch. And starting with the AmiAmi card, uh, they finally put the artworks back in. Uh, they used to do a bunch of comics, but this time it's some AmiAmi uh, artwork and yeah, they look pretty cute. Put that aside and let us start off with this bad boy right here. So this is, if you remember correctly from one of my previous videos, uh, the pre-order video that I made. This is a Madoka 10th anniversary merch, um, starting with this one. This is the acrylic stand that I have been looking for, I believe. It was around 5,000 yen, which is pretty steep for an acrylic stand, but listen, the illustration is super cute. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited to open this. So packaging, pretty standard packaging, comes in bubble wrap. Uh, it has the screws and everything to make the acrylic stand uh, stand up, I guess. And yeah, let's just get this unwrapped. And looking at what is here, we have the base, I believe. Yes, this is the base, clear base with some party streamers on it to celebrate, again, Madoka's 10th anniversary, which was last year, 2021, uh, which is crazy because I can't believe this anime is still popular, as popular as it is 10 years later. And then we have this, the stand with the Madoka girls on it. There is Mami, Kyoko, Sayaka, Madoka, and Homura, as well as Kyubei and uh, Bebe down there. Uh, Bebe or Nagisa, uh, depending on how you perceive uh, her, I guess. And then it also comes with this. Uh, I'm not sure what, uh, where this goes, but we'll be able to put it together. Uh, comes with instructions, I hope. It does not come with instructions, so we're gonna have to figure it out ourselves. Give me one second while I try to put this together. <laughs> All right, so I finally figured out how to put this stand together. Honestly, it's been like 15 minutes since I last cut the camera, but I finally was able to get the uh, stand together and the girls look great. I mean, there's Mami, Kyoko, Sayaka, Madoka, Homura, Kyube, and of course Nagisa on the cake. Again, it's for the 10th anniversary. You can see it right here. 10th anniversary for Madoka in which was in 2021. And yeah, this thing was a pain in the ass to put together, but it looks really cool. It's just three acrylic panels just put together and then you just screw the top and the bottom in. But yeah, is this worth $50? Look, I'm a big Madoka fan, and for me, it would be worth $50, but $50 for an acrylic stand is absolutely insane, and if you're not a super, super big fan of the series, I wouldn't buy any acrylic stand for $50, but because it's me and it's the 10th anniversary of Madoka, there's only one 10th anniversary, I had to pick it up. Okay, so that took way longer than it should've, but Let's move on to the next item, which is another 10th anniversary Madoka item. And this I'm super excited about. So this is like, it's not a duffel bag, but it's a bag which uh, is a lot bigger than I expected. And it looks super high quality from the uh, look of it. And if I can get this open, there we go. We have the 10th anniversary Madoka bag. And honestly, I saw this on AmiAmi. 
available for uh, available to buy still. Uh, it's already mid-February, and I'm really thinking about doubling up on it because feeling it, it's a really high quality bag. I mean, some high quality handles over here. And of course, if you look inside, there is the photo of the acrylic stand, which I just bought of Madoka, uh, Homura, Sayaka, Kyoko, and Mami to celebrate the 10th anniversary. The bottom is, uh, it's not real leather, but it's, uh, I guess it's a somewhat convincing feeling leather, uh, pretty shiny. And then there's the 10th anniversary patch as well on it and the Puella Magi Madoka Magica branding on the front. And then if you look in the back, you can see just a world of witches, which is super dope. Uh, printed pretty high quality. Uh, there's just the witches on the back as well as uh, Charlotte or Bebe or Nagisa, however you see her on the back as well in this witch's labyrinth. So this is a really, really cool bag. Uh, I do wish the inside did have the witch pattern as well, but yeah, this is a pretty great bag and I think I got it for 4,000 yen. And I will definitely be using this when we go out manga shopping and this is where I will be carrying everything pretty much. But yeah, 10th anniversary Madoka bag, super dope. And I'm really glad I bought it and I'm thinking of doubling up if it's still available on Ami Ami. However, putting that aside and putting this acrylic stand aside because of this final box is super long, no homo. It's super massive um, because if y'all didn't know, based on this shirt, which is a new game shirt, this is a life-size wall scroll of one of my favorite characters in anime, Alba Suzukaze. So I saw this on Ami Ami up for pre-order. Uh, actually, I think one of my people on Twitter, they messaged me that, hey, this is available for order. And I was like, bet, I will definitely order this. And yeah, this is the most expensive wall scroll I've ever ordered. It was, I think, around 6,800 yen <laughs> because it's life-size. But if you can see it, here's the wall scroll. It is of Alba Suzukaze. It is an illustration from the manga of her in a wedding dress. There was also a Hifumi one, but I'm not like a super massive Hifumi fan. I love Hifumi, but compared to Alba and Yagami, those two are my absolute favorite characters of the series. But I don't know if you can see it. But this is a life-size wall scroll of Alva Suzukaze, and it is absolutely massive. I mean, <laughs> I honestly don't know where I'm going to put this um, because I'm kind of out of space. But yeah, if you can see it, I'm standing. <laughs> I got to stand up for this. Yeah, life-size Alba poster. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I believe it's five foot seven. Uh, I'm not five seven, I'm five ten. But with it hanging from, I guess I'm gonna hang it from a push pin. I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna hang it from a push pin, I think. But this is ridiculous. Um, super big, super high quality. Just Alba in a wedding dress. Uh, yeah, super cute. And I think I'm gonna hang it in the corner by my computer station. Um, I'm gonna have to take down uh, the Misaka and other new game posters I have there, but yeah, it is a sacrifice we'll have to make for a life-size album. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the haul. Super short video, I know. I'm really sorry, um, but yeah, we have a lot of good stuff coming in the coming months. A lot of Persona 5 stuff, given that I am loving the game so far, so there's that. But with all that being said, I appreciate you coming back to the channel. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. We'll be doing more of these unboxings every month as I get my orders. But yeah, thanks for returning to the channel, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.